So here's uh, one of the rails for the deal here. I'm going to go ahead and I'll remove it. And we'll go open it back up again. Let's see. Where's the original view? So when you load it in here, it's going to be like this. It's going to stick out here. You're going to have to click on it. And now you can drag it. I like to do is pull it right about here and put it about in the middle and then we'll go here we we'll click over here to rotate and we just drag it around in a circle like that and then we'll go here we'll click on this to view it from here and then we'll click here and then we'll just go slide it to where we need it and then we'll go check our view. So you're ready to print this thing on a 200 millimeter by 200 millimeter printer. And normally you would need a 310 millimeter printer to print. Uh, so you can print it and that's how this one was printed. So we're gonna print another one. Um, they, they tend to want to lift like this, so if you have an enclosure and you're using PETG, um, it probably would help. I don't think I'd want to print this out of PLA. I just, I don't trust it. It's too brittle. Um, so, um, what I'm <coughs> trying to do, I, I print supports. Um, this one here was actually printed on a really crappy printer with no supports. And it somehow was able to bridge everything. Uh, you know, you, you'll have to clean it up and everything, but I mean, I, I was really amazed that it was able to print without supports on a really crappy printer. So, um, but, uh, I did 50% infill on this, so I'm going to copy the other one and do 50. Um, if you were to do 10% infill, you might want to come in and change some other things like the, uh, wall thickness. Uh, but what I'm doing is I'm going to change this to, uh... 50% and then I'm going to print another one, but I just wanted to show you that you, some of these things that you think you can't print, you, you can print, you just got to turn them sideways. And it's a little bit tricky of navigating like Cura. It's even worse navigating something like Creality Print. Uh, so anyway, I'm going to do that and uh, I'll have some more videos for you guys today. I'm just kind of, no, I'm not recovering. I'm just kind of sick today. So I'll just, uh, you know, just taking it easy, and I'm going to try and get a bunch of things printing. I might put together another uh, printer enclosure, because I have another one that I've never put together. And then uh, I'm going to print this one on the same printer, just so they're identical. And then I'll start printing some stuff on the uh, Neptune 4 inside the enclosure. And then I'm going to start redesigning uh, a new one that I can sell. So we'll catch you guys in a little bit.